My name is Isha Mascara Shet and I am founder and creative director at Missillo. We run an organic baby brand based out of Mumbai and we retail purely online. I studied BA graphic design at Central St. Martins. So I chose to study at UAL because I wanted to get out of my comfort zone in India. I've been brought up here and lived here my whole life and I was looking forward to studying in an environment which is truly global and cosmopolitan. It's a dream for someone from India and to be living in London, especially as a student and living independently and having so much exposure and freedom. My favorite thing about my course was probably how it taught me to work on a lot of self-initiated projects where we had to set our own brief and we had to, you know, sort of solve the design problem as well. So my work at Missillo, I'm going to be honest, it's not purely design driven just because I now run a business. I have to manage numbers, I have to manage stock and inventory. So my passion is definitely on the creative side of it. So I try and take that on more than any of the other stuff. But it's really, really been an amazing journey to have that whole experience versus just dealing with only the design part of the brief. So we started off with just me, it's like a one person team. I spent quite a few months in developing the product and the brand. It did help to have Central St. Martins on my CV. When I was talking to people from the industry and kind of getting feedback and putting my business together. And then as we launched in the summer of last year, we got two members on board and today we've grown to 10. From an organizational point of view, I think things are a lot easier and streamlined and organized in the UK. In India, at least, what I've been working with is hand craftsmanship like hand block printing and Indian stitching techniques and stuff. I'm, I'm really enjoying working with my textile arts from my country and really developing that in a modern global way. So I think one of the main differences in arts education in India and the UK would probably be that in India, if you were good at drawing or if you were able to copy real life, you know, that show your skill of being an artist or a designer in a very sort of straightforward way. I think that's what they were focusing on then. And whereas in the UK, I found them focusing more on the ideas and the thought and the execution would follow, whereas this was more execution based. So the process of moving to London, it can be overwhelming initially, but once you, you know, get used to the tube, commuting on your own, you know, you're a citizen there in London, you're not just a student, it's not a sheltered campus. Within the first month, I loved it and I go back every year. Yeah, it's second home for me now. Go for it, is what I would say if you want to study at UL. Um, I think you won't, you won't regret it for sure.